I, I think that what you see here are a whole bunch of police doing what they do, protecting a bunch of racist thugs. Without the police, those 14 Nazis would be dead right now. And how the police think? fight on their side. I'm old enough to remember the Civil Rights Movement when they fought us. I'm old enough to remember the Anti-War Movement when the police fought us. But when the Nazis come, the police protect them. It makes me disgusted. I've got a saying, without the cops, the Nazis leave in a box. What do you think of this? Yeah, I think it's important that people have the right to assemble, but I'm really happy to see the counter protesters out here standing up for what we believe in. I think it's hilarious. Why, why? Uh, it's just a scene. They don't deserve the attention. <laughs> of course, I'm here to watch it. Yeah. Why are you here? Why, why did you come? I came to support my son who's marching against racism. <laughs> what do you think of the rally so far? I think it's pretty peaceful, which I'm very happy about. I believe in freedom, freedom of speech for everybody, unlike most of the people here. Um, so I'm glad that it's peaceful and people are staying on their own side of the line. I was just walking by and I saw this march. What do you think? Uh, they're a bunch of fools. Really? Who? Which ones? These people out here. What, what, people. What, which, what are they? I don't look like South Africans. I lived in South Africa for two years. They were fools then and they're fools now. Racist. The racist pigs. Seeing something like this go down in 2012 is ridiculous. You know, we should, well, as a world, we should be trying to come together, not segregate. And it's the only way anything's ever going to work. 
I live for America, I work for America, and I love this country, and I can't stand socialism, I can't stand communism. The only good communist is a dead communist. Thank you, sir. Hold your, hold your own.